What's up, Life Bright Nation? Hey, what's going on, guys? So, we have a couple of really freaking fantastic surprises for this you guys in this video. For us, for you, for... <laughs> for everyone. We're so stoked. But before we get into it, there's something about Kevin that most of y'all might not know. And that is that Kevin here is a complete and utter tire whore. You s***. Brittany. Yeah. <laughs> no, but for real though, he, he genuinely is. So I, I do, I do like tires. Tires can change the way a whole entire vehicle looks and performs. performs. And before our Jeep, we had a Land Cruiser. So we had a 1995 FZJ80 Toyota Land Cruiser. That came with 35 inch BFG KO2s. That's the tires that were on it. That's what we learned. Good tire, off. decent tire. That's what we learned off-road on. From there, I went to an MTZ P3. Those are Mickey Thompson in a 35 inch as well. Then I went to a 37 inch Cooper STT Pro. Awesome tire, we loved those. Very good tire. Then what did we go to? 40 inch. Goodyear Wrangler MTRs. Those were actually really cool looking, very unique, the, the Kevlar, si well. Kevlar sidewall. And then I went to 40 inch. STT Pros, because <laughs> STT again, Pros. we really loved those. They, These, they performed really well. This is all within like one year on the, on the, on the Land Cruiser. In typical Kevin fashion. <laughs> and then of course you skip over to the Jeep where we almost instantly changed out the factory 33s. KO2s, for, the BFG KO2s, to a 35 Cooper STT Pro. <laughs> again, we liked them. And then we went to 37 inch Goodyear Wrangler MTRs because we like those. And then from there is, we're sure at this point, everyone is fully aware, we swapped to the 38 inch Milestar Patagonia MT, which we really loved. It was great performance for a great price. And I think we've done a pretty good job, if you ask me, over the last two years. Showing how they over, work. Over a hundred <laughs> wheeling videos on how exactly the Milestars perform, where they perform really, really well, where they might not perform very well, but overall, they were honestly a great tire, especially for the price. Yeah, great tire for the price. But if you look, we're BFG, Goodyear. Cooper. Cooper. Mickey Thompson. Mickey Thompson. But there's like, there's one really big company that I, for some reason I haven't tried. There's one top tier tire brand that is missing from that list. And when we started doing our research on the Ultra 4 car for King of the Hammers, we really wanted to make sure we had the best edge possible to make sure we cross that finish line because this might be our only chance. Yeah, we, we're not planning on running KOH more than once. I mean, we, we'll see what happens, but we might run this only one time and we want to make sure we have the best possible chance of crossing the finish line. So after researching all the Ultra 4 races, seeing who podiums all the time. We noticed that there is one commonality in all the Ultra 4 race podiums and yeah. that was Team Nitto. So we would like to officially share with you guys the great news that for King of the Hammers 2021, show, show already, show already. we are going to be on Team Nitto. Guys, case specs. So these are 40 inch Nitto Trail Grappler K-Specs. And the K-Spec specifically was literally designed for King of the Hammers and taking the ultimate abuse that you find in any Ultra 4 race. And when we did our research, almost every single Ultra 4 podium had a Nitto driver standing on it. Well, not I mean, that not that we're gonna, no, we're not trying to podium here. I mean, it would be nice, but we, we wanted the best possible. <laughs> we wanted the best <laughs> chance possible to cross the finish line. Right. That's our ultimate goal. And the Nitto Trail Grappler is just another huge step to helping us achieve that goal. The sidewalls on these things are insanely strong and they do make a street version of the Trail Grappler, not the K-Spec, but a different one that is just really simply a different compound. And we've had nothing but great reviews when we've been asking around about people with not only the street legal version of the Trail Grappler, but also when we've talked to other racers that run on these, it's been nothing but great. And honestly, the proof is in the pudding when you look at the podium. So we're hoping that these bad boys here can help us make it to the finish line at the end of King of the Hammers. And then of course, since we are getting new tires, you guys might remember the state of our old wheels on the Ultra 4 car. They were utterly destroyed, essentially. The race rings were completely obliterated and several of the wheels even had dents in them. So it was gonna be really useless to throw brand new tires 
on those wheels. So instead we wrapped the Nitto Trail Grapplers in some Dirty Life race wheels. And aside from looking super bad, it also gave us the opportunity to swap to Teflon coated race lugs, which if you remember, we also had an issue with all of our old lugs coming loose all the time to the point where we might have lost one or two of them. And we were constantly having to torque them down, which is not how it should be. These should stay tight. We shouldn't have an issue and they're yellow. So they match the car. All right. So now what's really cool about Dirty Life race wheels is they actually have their DT series, which stands for dual tech, which I'm going to demonstrate for you right now. So this is one of their DT series wheels. And what that means is that you can run it as either a DOT standard wheel or is a beadlock. It's equipped for both. Now, if you wanna run a DOT standard wheel, it's pretty simple. You literally just mount your tire in your bead seat position like normal, and then you have a beadlock mimic kind of so ring So it's here. a beauty ring. It's a beauty ring. Yeah. It makes it appear as though it's a beadlock, but it's really not. It's just a DOT standard wheel, completely street legal. But if you do wanna equip the wheel to be a beadlock, you're fully capable of doing that without buying an entirely brand new set of wheels. To do that, all you really have to do is swap to a forged race ring right here. And what you would do instead is mount your tire in the beadlock position right here on the outer lip. And then you sandwich it with a forged beadlock ring right here. And ta-da, you have a beadlock wheel and tire combo. So it's, it's actually kind of cool. So you don't have to buy an entirely new set of wheels if you ever go from your standard DOT style into a more extreme off-roading where you need to equip your rig with a beadlock. You can do it all in the same wheel. And what's even cooler is these come in a 20 inch, which means 42s, can't lose with 42s. <laughs> and then lucky for us, we already had a perfectly capable pre-running vehicle to go with our race vehicle. And who doesn't want their pre-runner to match their race vehicle. So our Razor also got a new set of shoes to match the Ultra 4 car, which is kind of dope. And I'm super excited about well, I mean, testing them both out. I, we need the same kind of traction and yeah. tire tread and, you know, and then the wheels are just cool because they they match. They're the cool. same. Yeah. It, it just made sense to equip the side-by-side is equally to the Ultra 4 car as we could. That way when we're pre-running and we're going through these trails and trying to get a feel for them, uh, it kind of gives us an idea of what to expect. Yeah, and I'm not 100% sure, but I think these are almost like a K-Spec or this is just, I think it's just the one that they make, but the rubber on here is extremely soft, like really, really soft, kind of like the K-Specs on the Ultra 4 car now. So equal grip, I think, for weight. I mean, we'll find out. <laughs>
that you are honestly just as excited as we are. This is an awesome opportunity. These tires are freaking rad. And again, hopefully they give us the best possible advantage we can. Well, they do. To they cross do. the finish they line. absolutely do. Guys, this is crazy. Nitto, Team Nitto. Like, that is a so big... Excited big deal like there is uh, some amazing drivers on team dude Nitto lord and healy von getting junior like this it's a huge honor for us we're super excited that they even considered working with us for the ultra four car it's gonna be amazing guys we love you so much thank you for watching please don't forget to like subscribe and share remember you can find all your life right nation merch at lightbrightstudios.com all your life right nation decals at pixeldecals.com guys we love you so much and we'll see you next time Bye. With those glasses on, yeah. you look like kind of a rich kid who's going for a ride for the first time in something cool other than his dad's Lamborghini. <laughs> <laughs> and you're chewing the gum, which makes it, yeah, makes it yeah. it's like air, you're arrogantly chewing that gum. <laughs> Douche McGoosh. Douche McGoosh. <laughs> Yarbugger.